Okay, here's how to find the consumer and producer surplus with a tax. So uh, we're told that the tax is $4 per unit. Supply and demand meet here at four, so this is the equilibrium that we start out with. Uh, but since there's a $4 tax, the supply curve shifts to the left by $4, so find where that meets demand, and it meets right here. Okay, so now they're gonna sell 15 units. The price that the buyers pay will be six. Follow that down, $4 goes to the government, so this is the price the sellers get to keep. And then the amount that is kept by the government is gonna be this pink area right here. Okay, uh, and so that would be the $4 tax times the 15 units, which would be $60. 60 is the amount of the tax. The consumer surplus is the area below the demand curve and above the price that the buyers will pay. So this would be right here. And so that would be one half two times 15, which we can calculate in our head, it's just 15. And then the producer surplus is all the way down here. It's gonna be this orange triangle here. It's the area above the supply curve, but below the um, price that the sellers get to keep. So that would also be two times 15. So the producer surplus would be $15.